Horizon 3. There is some pretty extreme snowy weather. Uh, so we're, yeah, but we're, we're stopping short but, of calling them blizzards. But I think I think we're stopping short of calling them blizzards. Yeah, I think that's <laughs> fair. Um, blizzard like weather. Extreme, <laughs> there's the blizzard like weather. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> I mean, yeah, so, so if, you're, if you're British, you would probably refer to it as a blizzard, but you know, we, we do tend to exaggerate these things. That's, that is true. That is, that is a thing. Um, but yeah, it, well, the weather can really does descend and the, the fogging and everything will get really thick and you'll see yeah. lots of um, snow particles. I, and I know what you're saying. I, like, I, oh, oh. Close. Yeah, we've been here, haven't we? <laughs> uh, Deja vu. I know what you're saying. It doesn't, I don't think it gets as, oh, <laughs> as extreme as it did in Blizzard Mountain. Yeah. The, and, but, the, you know, the point of Blizzard Mountain was really, like, to, you know, to turn that up to 11 because that was the experience. Like, being on a mountain in a blizzard was kind of, like, you know, the, the point behind that, that expansion. Miles oh, away. I knew he was going to do it then. Miles away. Um, so, the book 92 <laughs> said, what do super wheel spins do? What to do super wheel spins? Well, they're like they're like wheel spins, but super. Uh, but super basically. <laughs> there are three reels rather. Oh, oh I thought it was gonna clip. Pretty close. Um, there are three wheels rather than one, um, and I think I'm right in saying I'm kind of looking at Ben now uh, across the monitor. <laughs> I think there's there's like a, a more rare or legendary, sort of more rare or legendary stuff goes into super wheel spins. So you get three things that stop. You win all of them, and you can win um, some of the best prizes in the game. And it, it is. It is super awesome, actually, when 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 they they all land and if you get you know three good things, um, it's pretty cool. It's cool. So like, I kind of knowing my luck, I'm just going to have the worst wheel spin luck ever. Oh, it, 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 always, it always happens. I've always got my fingers crossed, and then then I'll promising. fluke something. Hold on. Oh, Whoa! I can't. Can, can, right, you've been trying this all afternoon, right? Can we get? Ben and Ralph doing a little mini head-to-head. -head. Oh, no. oh, must, must, must <laughs> be. Right, so we get Ben and Ralph doing a little head-to-head -head on this one, right? Because Andy's been going at this all afternoon, okay? And he, he has struggled with it. it is, he's come close many a time, okay. right? But I feel like we should do, like, one go, like, I think one go each between you guys and rotate and see who can do it this first. Penalty shootout. No. Right, penalty shootout star. Yeah. And let's get a poll in the chat. Who do you think is going to win? Ralph? Or Ben, who is going to smash the bonus board? Wow. So I, I feel like if you do this first time, you're going to be coloured. Oh, oh dear. Hold on. Oh, right. You know that was in line. You just didn't I was have all right. The speed. I was you didn't right. have the speed. Oh, sorry. I should have. Okay. Um, yeah. But while Ben and Ralph are doing this, we can still ask questions. So get him involved in the mixer chat. Get ask any question you've got for Winter in, in Forza Horizon 4. Anything totally to do with the game. Away, Go ahead and answer them. And remember, if you're getting involved on mixer.com forward slash Forza Motorsport, oh, God, you have God, a God, chance God, God, of no. winning a in-game cosmetic <laughs> item, which could be whispered to you um, as Ben goes it's, flying it's, miles away. So it's over there? It's over there, yeah. yeah, yeah. Got yeah. It, got you it. need to go left, like, uh, a lot more. No, it looks it's really, really easy. Like you see it, it's just all you got to do is go down a tube and just turn left. So there is a reason. Oh, no. Re oh, oh no. So, <laughs> yeah. there is a Rewind, <laughs> rewind. <laughs> oh, um, also, Ben, all right, I'm just saying, I didn't do this, right? But someone has, the, the poll has put you as tree. Oh, oh fantastic. Right. fantastic. It, it, wasn't, it wasn't me. Yeah. But I'd just like to point out, for those of you but wondering. you are winning. Right. So, so shout out to the guy who was selling uh, printer cartridges who sent me an email <laughs> and actually, um, Referred to me as Tree in the email. That was great. <laughs> <laughs> Did so you buy any? Tree. Did uh, you? I haven't bought any yet, but um, uh, I, you know, I definitely will at some point. At some point, yeah. yeah some get, point. get those just just for the Tree point. Well, but yeah, like... Tree, you you've got 53% of the vote so far. So guys, if you haven't already voted, who do you think is going to win, Ralph or Tree? Right. Oh, it's looking good. That is good. That's good. It's good. It's good. Oh. No. Oh. That's heartbreak. Yeah. You needed like two more miles an hour <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> going. Um, so we've got another question from PTG. Uh, PTG Dan says, can you force a season change via a blueprint? Yes. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Uh, you can choose when you blueprint uh, uh, an event, you can choose any of the seasons. Right, so there we go. And also, it's Fizz says, is there still animals in winter? 
Yes, there absolutely is. And they carve tracks in the snow just as the cars do. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, if you chase the sheep. How are the sheep? What's the sheep's volume like? The well, sheep's volume. It's yeah. quite volumous. The, it's, the volume is at its highest. Yeah. That is highest. You don't, you, do, you don't want those guys to get cold. Ralph, right. well, you, do you want to know you do? You, like... you don't want to hit the first right. bit. <laughs> so, I, I'm just. <laughs> what you need to do is go through. Uh, through the, I mean, I've just realised we've been place, at this for right. so long, the sun is coming back. Yeah, up. yeah. It's when it sets again. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh. Uh, right, okay, I'm giving this back to you. <laughs> <laughs> they can't, ha like, can I, can I have one go to just go through a thing? Because I've looked at this all day, right, and I am determined that this cannot be that difficult. Right, this is, you know that moment Famous it can backfire? Words. Right. Um, okay, uh, will we be able to change seasons uh, in private free roam? Free roam. Uh, no, you won't. No, you won't. So, um, up, except for using um, the blueprint system, uh, you you will be on the, the sort of server controlled, or if you're offline, the system clock uh, version, so that everybody experiences them at the same time. All right, sweet. And um, are you guys ready for the uh, single single attempt? Right. I mean, and that is go. that is pitiful. Right, we, 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 we're doing a we're doing it with a barrel spin. Come on, please. Okay, no, I didn't have a spin. <laughs> right, guys, there's a rewind feature for a reason. I'm going to do one more and then pass it back to Andy, right? Because you know we've got we've got questions to answer, and I just need a bit more speed. I'm not. I don't come up with excuses, by the way. Like, it is, no, no, that's I've noticed. Hmm? It's, it's the occasional <laughs> thing. But what other features are there in winter? So we've seen the snow. We've seen like the frozen lakes. That, it's a it's a little yeah, tricky. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm thinking yeah. about the thread and needle mode. So I, I I got riddled at E3. So with the, well, on the showcase, which had the bikes mm. in it, um, I went in and practiced before our live stream, which Ben was involved in a lot. Uh, and I um oh oh that's it. Oh. oh. It was, I mean, that's I'm cool. sorry. That's I'm, I, I went for style points as I passed to Andy. Right? You know, I didn't want to smash the board. I wanted Andy to do it. Um, so, should we kind of have a look at a race? Because we've, yes. we've, we've looked at some of the Let's bonus boards. Should we go have a look at a race and see how that kind of changes in winter um, compared to the other seasons? Of the yes. yes. And also remember, guys, if you want to go check out the other seasons, um, the vods are available that you can go watch and go check it out, so you can see what the game looks like in summer and autumn. And next week, we are going to be looking at spring on Tuesday as well. And um, Andy is finding it hard to move away from the board. He's the same, same thing. He's like, I want to smash the board as we go to a race. Uh, but also, we've got some um, more uh, questions coming in. So guys, get him, get him in the mixer chat as we kind of head on. We looked at mud last week, mm. OK? And this, I think we we buy actually the 4 by 4 place, which we, is a we lot are more in it. Yeah. mud. Like, how much does it change? Because it seems a lot more crunchy. <laughs> you know what I mean, though? Yeah. So, so yeah, so this is, um, uh, I, I guess, winter's version of deformable mud, like deformable snow, which, I, you know, we sort of first, uh, we first had in the Blizzard Mountain expansion. Um, and, yeah, there's, there's a bunch of different uh, depths to the deformable snow that you'll find in the game. Um, as Ben said earlier, also, you know, it's not just all snow. There's also some areas in the south which are just frosty. Uh, there's roads which are cleared and roads which are not. And roads which are kind of like, you know, uh, I, I guess British people will uh, um, recognise this kind of uh, this kind of road from uh, from when it does snow, as it did earlier this year. Beast um, from the east. The beast from the east. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Did, um, did you kind of was that kind of like as a game developer, like the dream moment to happen, especially when you're working Forza Horizon Four? You knew you were having winter in there. Was that just like kind of like a gift where you're like? If you're working on a game it? based in the UK with winter in it, then yes, yeah, there was a... Yeah. I mean, it's fair, it's fair to say that, I mean, every season has kind of been the perfect season yes. this, <laughs> yeah. this, this uh, past couple of years. So yeah, it's been, it was awesome. And we, you know, we absolutely went out and didn't just have fun building snowmen. We went out and got... Is that the snowman that needed. we knocked over earlier? Was that yours? Uh, <laughs> was that your snowman? <laughs> we're like, all right, we're going to build a snowman for the game. I mean, actually, the guys had, you know, they had to do the, the difficult... A uh, painful task of going to that same 4 by 4 park uh, in the in the snow <laughs> to drive it just because um, Andy absolutely needed to find out how the cars were, were handling on a combination of mud and snow. It was apparently very important. Yeah, it was very very. I'm, important. I'm not surprised. Did he did he kind of push for it hard? He, uh, I need to go. It needs to be right. Yeah, absolutely, yeah. Um, but, and to be fair to him, came back with some pretty good reference, and uh, it's it's made for a pretty authentic experience inside that park. So. What else, um, like, what kind of else did you kind of get from the beast from the east to kind of put into, um, to put into Port Horizon 4? I think the other thing is maybe, like, you remember how long that, that sort of lasted? Like, quite often in, the, in Britain, you get that thing where it snows and then 
very quickly melts away. But I think because we had that real harsh cold winter, everything froze and stuck mm -hmm. around for quite a long time. So, so we got to experience what that, you know, you've got that slushy sort of look to, to the roads you get in, in uh, yeah. Britain when it starts to melt, which is totally fair. <coughs> but also when you get a real hard frost on tarmac, that's something that we don't necessarily see all that often, but we got to experience lots of it during that particular part of the year. And that's, um, that's something that we've you know, managed to replicate. You kind of get the kind of same slipperiness at kind of going at that speed as well, because where you have to kind of change your style of driving to kind of compensate for that kind of like ice and that slush. Absolutely, and there's, there's some other like specific things going on, which I, I know the car handling guys have got really, really into and, and made quite a few observations around which they weren't expecting, which is just the, the sudden shocking drop in temperature on the tyres mm. when you hit a snowy surface. Did some really um, unexpected things to the way the cars were handling inside the physics model. Um, which gives you this whole new sort of layer of depth to the driving experience in winter in certain areas of the map. Yeah, we, and also because, like Ralph, we, you you've, you said it straight from the offset at the start of these streams that winter was your favourite season, right? What is it that makes like winter your favourite? So I th I think for me the the biggest thing is I think it's incredibly powerful when a game can change the way it looks completely. Mm. You know, like I you know I, I'm sure I'm I'm not alone in you know. Loving games, playing games a lot, and then when you do, when you when you absolutely love a game, when you play it a lot, um, you get you get super familiar with it. You, you you totally understand every inch of you know that the world that you're, you're playing in. Um, and what this game, and in particular winter within this game, does is on a really regular basis completely change the way the world looks. So that when you return to it. You know, sure, it's the same world that you've been playing in, it's the same roads that you know, um, but it looks so completely different that it's almost kind of like just refreshing. Yeah, like I, I always throw back to the, playing the E3 demo um, when you kind of went through that, that kind of like demo track and you were actually going down the same road, mm. but no one really noticed because it was so drastically different, yeah. um, which is kind of going to be amazing. We saw the map, the map as well, which is uh, you guys have actually shared on Instagram and Twitter. Yeah, and if, yeah. if anyone wants to go check that out, um, go to Instagram or Twitter at Forza Motorsport on Twitter or at Forza Motorsport Official on Instagram and you can check out the map in winter because it looks so different, Completely just the map yeah, um, and, and, from what we saw last week. And to jump on your point about it you know, looking super different, you didn't recognise it. I think that's actually true for a bunch of the guys on the development team as well. You know, the, the first time we, we did that, that route and we started working on it, People were surprised when they heard that that was the same stretch of road we were using, which was kind of validation for us that it really did feel and, and look like a very different experience. And there's the white space again as yeah. well, which yeah. is which is always nice to see. Uh, but we've got a few. We can get in a couple last questions, guys. So if you've got any last questions, this is your chance to get them in, get them answered by Ralph and Ben uh, as we kind of come up to the end. Because what do we have on next week as well? Because next week is the final season. It's the final season. It's the final show. What will we do with Tuesday nights after that? Um, <laughs> We are, we've, we've built up quite a debt, haven't we? We've promised that we will show Edinburgh, so we will. We've promised that we'll show competitive team racing, so we will. Um, I can't remember if we promised any other things, but we almost in inevitably This have. is the moment where I kind of need to just try and get you to promise more things, because then it's just well, like so we can then get more things next um, week. So yeah, I know, I know obviously uh, it goes without saying spring. We will be showing spring. Um, I think we'll, we'll, probably, uh, we'll probably drop the spring map in the same way we have the winter map on social media this uh, next week as well, so there's a ton of stuff um, coming up in our final show next week. Well, we also have a poll. What is the fake, wait, hold on, I want to see this poll that's going on. What's your favorite, so guys, we have a poll that's going on right now. What is the favorite season of Forza Horizon 4 that you've seen so huh. far? So you've seen summer, you've seen autumn, and you've seen winter, right? So get involved, let us know what you think. Which is your favorite? Do you kind of agree with Ralph that winter's your favorite? Because um, like, for, for me, I, I really enjoyed summer just because I really like those high speed races and kind of going along the motorway, um, I thought was awesome. Uh, and also, I think Ben really enjoyed autumn last week. Cause of, you I know, do love you autumn, know, yeah, yeah. You so know, all the trees. Yeah, I yeah, love, it's love so it. golden and romantic. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> it is the one. Uh, but we're coming up to the end of the stream today, guys. So I hope you've enjoyed everything. Um, this has been winter. So many awesome new features to have. A, we've taken a look at. Um, so I think we should just talk about next week as well. Just, just a little next week. We've got spring next week. We're doing spring. We're doing Edinburgh. We're doing some uh, competitive team adventure, which is our competitive online uh, uh, mode. Uh, 